So here I'm going to show how to create a hollow cube, uh, like the one seen here. Go to create tab, box, and we can use keyboard entry. Let's make it 10 by 10 by 10. So here my XYZ location is all zeros, all dimensions 10. Hit create, and go modify tab. Uh, you want to turn edge faces on here at the shading level. And uh, let's increase the segments. Okay, then we'll go modifier list, add an edit poly modifier. I'm going to select one of these edges, hit loop, and then chamfer it. Four inches, hit OK and grab another one, hit loop, and chamfer settings, 4 inches, hit OK, and last one, loop, chamfer, set to 4 inches, hit OK, now I'm going to switch to polygon mode, select the top and the bottom by holding the control key, and hit bridge, I want to connect that polygon, or I'm sorry, bridge that polygon to this inside. But I first have to chamfer these lines on the inside. So we're going to go select by edge, select one vertical edge, hit ring, and hit connect. Set to one, hit OK. Then hit chamfer, and set to four inches, hit OK. Alright, so now I'm going to grab the inside polygon the outside one, hit bridge, and we'll go all the way around and do this. So I have two polygons there, hit bridge, again, and once more, bridge. Okay, so here we have hollow cube. We switch to orthographic view, isometric, and here you can add a turbo smooth increase the segments a few times and turn on ISO line display. So this is what it looks like smoothed without any control edges.